<laughs> All right, hey guys, sorry it's been so long, but um, well, things have been a lot of things coming up, been busy, don't ask. Anyway, I'm going to start with the review here today, and today I'm going to be reviewing War for Cybertron Leader Class Optimus Prime. It says Galaxy Update or something like that. I don't have the box, so I don't know, but, um, just looks like the one from Transformers Cybertron. Since I don't really know the name, I just call this one Cybertron Optimus. Anyway, whatever. Anyway, as you can see here, he has his armor on. I did this because I'm actually going to go into the full review today. Especially once the actual process of transforming it, but... You know how it is. Anyway. He has... Accessories-wise, he has... Okay, I'm just going to count the ones that are attachable. He has two of these guns. Right here. And he has this little thing that detaches. Other accessories are actually... Well, I don't know if I would call them accessories, but still. Anyway, whatever. He's got lots of rustic detail on him. Yeah. I can't figure out why these are on hinges. Like, um, like, right here. Yeah, I tried. I can't bend that. I don't know why. If you guys can leave a comment why they're there. I might... I don't know what it, whatever. Anyway. And that's it. He also has little things on, well... On his back. Called wings. <laughs> yeah, that's a stupid thing. Whatever. Anyway, yeah. He has two little cannons. Now, I actually found something cool that I personally like. You don't have to do it, but I just like it. Take his guns out. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. And just put them above him like this. Looks pretty cool, if I do say so myself. And again, it's your toy, so whatever. Anyway. Galaxy... Whatever. The Cybertron Optimus Prime. Oh, 21st century. Never mind, I just lost whatever. Anyway, and I'll be back with its Voyager mode. And we are back, and here is Voyager Optimus Prime. Now, this Voyager Optimus Prime is actually quite good. Heal it up, I'll give you an example. Never mind. Anyway, uh, I couldn't find one. Anyway, whatever. Yeah, he got pretty much looks the exact same as Ultra Magnus. I will do a review on him later. Until then, he will remain anonymous. Whatever. Anyway, you can see here. He has pretty much kind of the G1 Optimus Prime look. He pretty much just looks like G1 Optimus Prime, except for a bunch of differences. Besides the chest, I know everyone's saying, the chest, the chest, it's the only thing probably. I'm talking about more. For instance... His, like, uh, waist part right here. Also, the back. It's not red, it's blue. If it was red, okay. Also, gun. I know, I know, on the box it says he has holding these two guns. But still, you know what I mean. Anyway, you know what it says on the box he's holding these two guns? Yeah. But, we just gotta admit this gun's better looking in his hand. It looks more like the Optimus Prime gun, except for the color, back thing, whatever, than others. Yeah. His feet. Yeah. His feet. If you spot any differences. However, I would have liked if Hasbro made, like, this Optimus Prime, the one that, um, hasn't, like, the one from Transformers Cybertron without the arm. It would be it would be better looking like that because think of never mind wait mm, never mind 
I think I just thought of something, but I don't know what it is anymore. Whatever. Anyway, he has a bunch of stuff on him. A bunch of detailing here and there. By the way, if you have Ultra Magnus thing, if you don't know this, you can put on all the Ultra Magnus armor on him. Just not the um, head part. Sorry about the little pause. I got distracted for a sec. Anyway, you can't really put on anything. So, yeah. You can't really put on Ultra Magnus' head. So, yeah, you can only put on his little arm little things here. Shoulders, legs. Weapon. Sorry, got the pause. Got distracted. Anyway, yeah, I think we'll get into his truck mode. And here he is in truck mode. Gotta admit. Okay, now this one actually does look like... I don't know, I don't... I don't actually have the original Cybertron as this Prime. I um, don't have a photo with me right now to see the difference, but whatever. It actually kind of looks like him. Well, it looks a bit shorter here, but still. Not much. So I could combine some G1 Optimus from Truck and Cybertron Optimus Prime, and I really like how they did that. Anyway, we'll be back with the final phase. All right, here we are back with his fire truck form. Dang, I think it was a fire truck in the first place. So, whatever. He's got really true. It looks like his form from uh, from based off of what I know. It kind of looks like a Cybertron toy. I'm gonna have to cut it short on this review now. I know. <laughs> I'm kidding. Whatever. Anyway, I got some stuff to do. So, goodbye.